What are ore deposits? Ore deposits are naturally occurring concentrations of minerals that are economically valuable and can be extracted for various purposes, primarily for the production of metals and other industrial materials. These deposits are formed through geological processes over extended periods of time and can be found in a variety of geological settings. Minerals that make up ore deposits are typically metallic elements or compounds, and they occur in a variety of forms, such as sulfides, oxides, carbonates, and silicates. The concentration of these minerals in a specific location is what distinguishes an ore deposit from the surrounding rock. The economic viability of mining and extracting these minerals depends on factors such as the mineral content, accessibility, and market demand. Ore deposits can be classified into several types based on their geological origin and the processes that led to their formation. Here are some common types of ore deposits. Magmatic deposits, these are formed from the crystallization of minerals from a magma. As the magma cools, certain minerals crystallize out and accumulate to form ore deposits. Examples include copper, nickel, and platinum group element deposits. Hydrothermal deposits, these form when hot, mineral-rich fluids circulate through fractures and porous rocks. As these fluids cool and react with the surrounding rocks, they deposit minerals. Common hydrothermal deposits include gold, silver, and base metal deposits. Sedimentary deposits, some ores are formed through the accumulation and concentration of minerals in sedimentary environments. For example, banded iron formations, BIFs, are sedimentary rocks that contain iron-rich minerals and are a major source of iron ore. Metamorphic deposits, or deposits can also form during the metamorphism of existing rocks. Changes in temperature and pressure can lead to the concentration of certain minerals, resulting in deposits of valuable ores. Placer deposits, these are formed by the mechanical concentration of heavy minerals, such as gold or diamonds, in riverbeds or other sedimentary environments. The minerals are often concentrated by the action of water, gravity, and other natural forces. Mining and extracting ore deposits involve various methods, such as underground mining, open pit mining, and heap leaching, depending on the depth, location, and characteristics of the deposit. Once extracted, the ores undergo processing to separate the valuable minerals from the waste rock, and further refining processes may be employed to obtain the desired metal or material in its pure form. Ore deposits play a crucial role in supporting industrial and technological advancements, as they are the primary sources of many essential metals and materials used in manufacturing, construction, and other sectors of the global economy. The exploration and development of new ore deposits continue to be important activities for ensuring a stable supply of these valuable resources. What is geology of ore deposits? The geology of ore deposits is a specialized branch of geology that focuses on the study of the origin, formation, distribution, and classification of mineral deposits that contain economically valuable elements or compounds. This field is essential for understanding the geological processes that lead to the concentration of minerals, the identification of potential ore bodies, and the development of effective exploration and extraction strategies. The geology of ore deposits involves the integration of principles from various geological disciplines, including mineralogy, petrology, geochemistry, structural geology, and economic geology. Mineralogy and petrology, understanding the mineralogical composition of ore deposits is fundamental to unraveling their geological history. Different minerals have distinct properties, and the identification of key minerals in or bodies helps geologists decipher the conditions under which these minerals formed. Petrological studies also provide insights into the types of rocks associated with or deposits and the alteration processes that may have affected them. Geochemistry Geochemical analyses are crucial for characterizing the composition of both the ore minerals and the surrounding rocks. Geochemical data help geologists trace the source of elements and understand the processes that led to their concentration. Isotope studies, in particular, can provide valuable information about the age of the ore forming events and the sources of fluids or magmas involved. Structural geology, 
the study of the structural features of the Earth's crust is essential for understanding how ore deposits are hosted within rock formations. Faults, folds, and other structural elements influence the shape and orientation of ore bodies. Knowledge of the structural setting helps geologists predict the geometry of ore deposits and assess their potential for exploration and extraction. Sedimentology and Stratigraphy In the case of sedimentary ore deposits, an understanding of sedimentology and stratigraphy is critical. Certain minerals accumulate in specific sedimentary environments, and the study of sedimentary rocks helps geologists interpret the depositional history of ore-bearing formations, such as banded iron formations and certain uranium deposits. Tectonics The broader tectonic context of a region plays a significant role in the formation of ore deposits. Tectonic processes, including plate movements, can create the conditions necessary for the concentration of minerals. For example, Convergent plate boundaries may lead to the formation of magmatic arc-related deposits, while rift zones may host sedimentary or hydrothermal deposits. Exploration geophysics, geophysical methods, such as seismic surveys, gravity measurements, and electromagnetic techniques, are often employed in or deposit exploration. These methods help identify subsurface structures, anomalies, and variations in physical properties that may indicate the presence of ore bodies. The interdisciplinary nature of the geology of ore deposits underscores the need for a holistic approach in studying and understanding these valuable resources. Geologists working in this field contribute to the exploration, exploitation, and sustainable management of mineral resources, playing a crucial role in supporting industries that rely on these materials for technological advancements, infrastructure development, and economic growth. Advances in geological techniques and technology continue to enhance our ability to discover and extract ore deposits while minimizing environmental impacts. What are ore forming processes? Ore forming processes are geological mechanisms that lead to the concentration of economically valuable minerals into deposits that can be extracted for industrial purposes. These processes involve a complex interplay of physical and chemical forces acting on the Earth's crust over geological time scales. Understanding these processes is crucial for ore deposit geologists, as it guides exploration efforts and informs mining strategies. Here are some key ore forming processes. Magmatic processes. Magmatic differentiation, as magma cools and solidifies, different minerals crystallize at different temperatures. This process, known as magmatic differentiation, can lead to the formation of ore deposits rich in specific minerals. For example, in layered intrusions, certain layers may contain concentrations of valuable minerals like chromite, platinum, or nickel. Magmatic hydrothermal processes, hot, mineral-rich fluids derived from cooling magmas can migrate through surrounding rocks, depositing minerals as they cool. This process often leads to the formation of hydrothermal ore deposits, such as porphyry copper and epithermal gold deposits. Hydrothermal processes. Fluid circulation and alteration, hydrothermal fluids, typically derived from water-rich solutions, migrate through rocks, dissolving and transporting minerals. As these fluids interact with the host rocks, they cause alteration, changing the mineralogy of the rocks and depositing or minerals. This process is common in the formation of many types of ore deposits, including lead zinc deposits and some gold deposits. Vein formation, hydrothermal fluids can create veins or fractures within rocks, filling them with minerals. Vein deposits, such as quartz veins hosting gold or silver, are a result of this process. Sedimentary processes. Chemical precipitation, certain minerals can precipitate directly from water in sedimentary environments. For instance, the formation of banded iron formations, BIFs, involves the precipitation of iron and silica from ancient oceans, creating economically significant iron ore deposits. Evaporite deposits, in arid environments, the evaporation of water can lead to the precipitation of salts and minerals. Evaporite deposits, such as those containing potash or halite, are formed through this process. Metamorphic processes. Metamorphic differentiation. During metamorphism, 
changes in temperature and pressure can cause the segregation and concentration of minerals. Metamorphic ore deposits, such as some graphite and talc deposits, form through this process. Fluid rock interaction Metamorphic fluids can interact with rocks, mobilizing and concentrating certain elements. This can lead to the formation of metamorphic hydrothermal ore deposits. Placer processes Mechanical concentration Physical processes like erosion, weathering, and river transport can mechanically concentrate heavy minerals, leading to placer deposits. Gold nuggets in rivers or alluvial diamond deposits are examples of placer deposits. Understanding these ore forming processes involves a multidisciplinary approach, combining aspects of mineralogy, petrology, geochemistry, and structural geology. Ore deposit geologists use various analytical techniques, including petrographic studies, geochemical analyses, and isotopic dating, to unravel the complex history of ore formation in specific geological settings. Advances in technology continue to enhance our ability to decipher the geological processes behind ore formation and contribute to the sustainable exploration and extraction of mineral resources.